Asteroid. Asteroid. Equator. Equator. Hardware. Hardware. Mission. Mission. Orbit. Orbit. Rotation. Rotation. Reaching for the stars. NASA, the United States National Aeronautics and Space Administration Agency, was created in the 1950s. Its mission was to lead the way in the exploration of space, both near Earth and beyond it, and in particular, to transport people to the moon and back by the end of the 1960s. This ambition of President John F. Kennedy's was, of course, achieved in 1969. In fact, 12 astronauts walked on the moon during a number of missions between then and 1972. NASA is divided into four departments. The Aeronautics Research Division is concerned with improving transport into and through space. The Space Technology Department develops hardware, software and machinery to improve space exploration. The Human Exploration and Operations Department oversees activity that involves people, including missions to the International Space Station, which is in orbit around Earth constantly. Finally, the Science Division helps to further understanding of the universe, including the Earth, which it studies by satellite. This division also includes the Office of Planetary Protection, and one of this office's responsibilities is defending the Earth from hostile aliens. NASA launches spacecraft from Cape Canaveral in Florida, which was chosen for its southerly position. Because the state of Florida is closer to the equator than most other US states, NASA rockets get maximum help from the rotation of the planet when they take off for space. However, NASA astronauts who are sent to the ISS now begin their journeys in Kazakhstan as the US brought its space shuttle program to an end in 2011. ISS missions now begin and end at the Baikonur Cosmodrome near Tayuratan in southern Kazakhstan. This is the same location from which Yuri Gagarin, the first man to go to space, began his journey back in 1961. 